with Victor Tracy, the Campfield 73s, second year 73. A little more comfortable this year. How much different is this year than last year? I mean, it's early, Victor. Well, I feel this year it's it's a tighter league overall. You know, everybody we've seen so far, you know, everybody beats everybody. So it's definitely more competitive to you know, get to the first spot and, you know, everything from there. Uh, a little bit of a brave killer last year. Here you come in at a couple game winners, uh, just the way it goes. Yeah, yeah, it's just the way it goes. You know, I'm just happy to be able to help out as much as I can. You know, it's don't know what it is, but I like playing here and I like playing against the Braves. You know, it's a good rivalry, so it's just happy to be able to step up, help my teammates out. Uh, you're a bit of a novelty. I think you're probably the uh, the only player in this league that's ever been born and raised in Stockholm, Sweden. And it wasn't just a quick transition. You were there for uh, quite a while. Yeah, yeah. I was uh, born and raised, so I was there for 18 years. And uh, I went over for the States and played uh, prep school for one year and then, yeah, my second year here. So it's a, it's a big difference, you know, definitely speed-wise and the size of the rink. It's it's definitely a big difference, if you can say that. So quite a quite a change, quite a culture shock. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely a change. But I don't know I feel like I fit in here. It's, it's nice to be in Canada too. It's a great country. So uh, in in Sweden, uh, a little different uh, makeup with hockey organizations. You guys had uh, probably more ice time than uh, we would over here. Is that correct? Yeah, yeah, you have uh, you have a lot of more ice time in Sweden, uh, especially usually you know around 15, 16 years of age, you uh, you move on and you pretty much you go to hockey school is what you call it over there. So what you do is you have a class three times a week, which is hockey. So one of your classes is hockey, and they grade you on it, and it's just extra ice time, and then every night you have of course practice. Does your role change any uh, getting back to uh, this year, your second year with the 73s? Does your role change any? Uh, I think a little bit, yeah. You know, you got to be you got to be a leader. You got to really step up to the plate for the young guys. Uh, you got to you know help out, show the way. Uh, pretty much, just you get a bigger bigger role as you know as the team progresses. You have to really really be involved in everything not just on the ice off the ice you know helping everybody out helping everybody get fit and where they are because you know it's a big big part of you know playing when you move away from home is feeling comfortable with where you are so that's the biggest difference good start uh, for the 73 so far yeah yeah great start you know we uh everybody's everybody's tight too as i said before so uh we just got to keep keep this going as far as we can uh, second time uh, within a week that you've uh, played the Brockville Braves uh, in, in Kemphill. The Braves came out 4-2. to two. What was that game like, Victor? Uh, well, that game was, you know, it was, it was a tough game for us. I feel like we we definitely learned a lot from it. And I think that we, uh, we looked over it all and we just got to keep playing our game. I think we lost a little bit of that during that game. But, you know, as we go back to our game and we start start moving our feet more, I feel like feel like we you know can be a big competitor against them thanks for doing this good luck tonight no thank you victor tracy the careful 73s